Hey y'all, I'm um, sorry I keep doing these videos at work, but I just, I, can't, I really, I don't even know what to say. It's just going to sound like a cop out if I say that I just don't have time, but really, I'm just tired all the time. I work 10, 11 hours in the day. I go home. If I'm not already sleeping, I do, you know, the house duties, the cooking, the cleaning, and then by the time I put my feet up, I look a mess, and it's like I'm not doing a video like this. And then when I go out and then I get a little, you know, done up, then it's like, okay, we're in the car. We have my stepdaughter and all, it's just, no. But since I'm on break, I figure I'll catch you guys up with a little bit of what I could catch you up on. Um, let I see, where am I going to start? I hit 24 weeks today, yay. Um, we've reached viability. Um, I had an appointment two days ago. And uh, everything went well. My appointment before that, when I went in at 18 weeks, um, I don't know if I already said it, but I'm at, I'm 24 weeks today. Um, thank God. Uh, when I first went in to see the maternal fetal doctor at 18 weeks, and we did the first level two ultrasound scan for both babies, uh, my boy had a a spot a white spot on his heart and the doctor weren't wasn't too um, concerned with it he says it's pretty common he sees it a lot and um, especially it's more common in Asian women and if he he's not that he's not worried about it if he was then he would send us to the heart doctor for babies but he's not um, we've seen him again three times since and um, the spot is still there, but the babies are growing, and he's still not worried about it. My placenta was low. Um, baby girl was, like, I think less, less, less than a centimeter from my cervix. So she wasn't covering it, but she wasn't where she was supposed to be, and they were hoping that she would move up, and she did. Um, my scan two days ago showed that she's were about two centimeters. She was up from... The placenta is moving up. Uh, I have my glucose test uh, in a couple of weeks. I hope I pass that because I've been eating everything sweet. In the beginning, I was into salty, and now I'm into sweet. Anything chocolate, cookies, cakes, anything, soda, anything. I, yeah, that's my thing right now. Um, aside from all that, I feel great. Nausea lifted and went away at 17-ish weeks completely and then it tried to come back around 20, 21 weeks and it still comes and goes now but I'm um, starting from two, about two weeks ago before two weeks ago I felt normal aside from the nausea and all that and the constipation but then starting up to two weeks ago I've been like extremely tired i'm feeling pregnant before then i felt pretty normal you know but now i'm starting to, i'm getting swollen with the heat and the humidity um oh another another fun thing i did some 3d ultrasounds um i bought everything i bought the dvd i bought the pictures and i i, I took a lot of pictures um I bought a lot from that and then I took a lot of pictures myself and with Franny and such and I'm thinking after all said and done I'm just going to pile all that up into one video. Um, I'm trying to think what else. I'm sorry I know I owe you guys like a good video but this it's always all over the place and I do apologize for that. I apologize for going MIA for so long. I tried. I was watching Crystal's, um, Crystalline's um, videos yesterday, and I did. I tried to take pursuit in that and do a week or a weekly vlog, pregnancy vlog, but I just can't. I can't keep up with it. I'm sorry. Um, so yeah, let me give you guys a belly shot. I. This is where we are. Side, front. I was there starting to show. And that's that other side. So it's, you know, they're coming. 
they are definitely coming it's i'm even with the belly and all um i just still can't believe i'm pregnant sometimes i still forget like i not forget but i i I just can't believe it and it's crazy. My sisters tell me, like, look at your belly. I feel babies moving, Franny's felt them, um, my stepdaughter, I, a lot of people's felt them because they just, they're getting stronger and they make themselves known, but it's awesome. I wish all the TTCers the best of luck and everybody that's still trying the best of luck. It happens and I can't believe it's happened to me finally. Um, I cannot believe it. Thank you, Jesus. I feel so blessed, and we're having one of each. Every time they scan me, I ask them to confirm it. Even though, you know, even two days ago, we still asked the, well, I still asked the, the ultrasound tech to confirm it, and it's, it's amazing. I can't believe we're having babies, never mind just a baby, just babies, and I, we feel so blessed, and, um, just don't give up. It's going to happen. And I know it It sounds cliche, but it, it does. I'm telling you, it will happen. You just take, you can take a break, but just don't give up. It'll happen. Um, I wish everyone the best of luck and have a great day.